Hey guys, what's going on? It's Jigsaw from Noah Gaming X. This is an update on Call of Duty Black Ops 2 Revolution DLC. Sorry about the picture size, that's what you got. But um, they have released info on an ad on Amazon and it gives descriptions of all the maps. And it's interesting because if you read the zombies one, let me tell you here. So Die Rise, this is what it says. The zombie apocalypse has invaded China, turning downtown into a dilapidated and dangerous MC Aster painting. So first thing we draw from that is China, right? It's in China. So you're going to have China style buildings. Uh, I don't know where that's going to take the storyline. We'll see. But we know it's in China. And um, downtown it says, so it's going to be an urban setting. And about the MC Esther painting that it says it's comparing it to. MC Esther, if you've ever seen the, uh, the like weird staircases, and it's really just kind of fucks with your mind. So I guess it's going to be a little bit maze-like in the urban uh, setting. So that's the zombies map. It gives descriptions for the rest of the maps too. So here we go. Hydro. This large map allows you to use the dam and water to your advantage to block paths and stop enemies. Now this is going to be an interactive map where you can change the water flow of the dam and you can block paths and strategically open up parts of the map, which I think is going to be really interesting. In the past, they've done kind of interactive things like this and they haven't really done much. I mean, the closest thing is like the doors on stockpile, but this should be cool, I think. Downhill, a medium-sized map based in French Alps, complete with snow chairlifts and a strategically placed lodge. So it's a snowy map, chairlifts, I don't know if they're going to be on or not, that'd be cool, and a lodge. So when I think of this, I kind of envision uh, a state from MW2, because there's like that one big building up on the hill. So we'll see, but that's going to be snowy, there's going to be a lodge. Next, Grind. Set within the local of Venice, California boardwalk, this small skate park is sure to deliver fast and frantic Call of Duty action. So Grind is going to be a small map within a skate park. I think this is going to be a fan favorite like uh, Firing Range or Nuketown because it's going to be a small map and players love small maps. Mirage, the Gobi Desert. I, I, oh, hold on. I don't know if I pronounced that now or not. Mirage, uh, whatever. It's in the Gobi Desert multiplayer map. Utilizes sand dunes to provide different levels of elevation and a sanctuary in the center as a natural choke point So when I think of this I think of turbine. I think of big open desert Just sniper map. That's what I think of and then the peacekeeper SMG Which is a gun you get gun DLC if you buy this and it says this impressive submachine gun fills the open weapon slot in your loadout with power and accuracy so that doesn't really tell us much you get a new weapon if you buy this. If you have the season pass, you get this and all map packs free. That's what the season pass does. I know there's some confusion about that. If you don't have the season pass, then it's probably going to be 800 Microsoft points for 10 bucks. This drops January 29th. Any trailers or anything like that, I'll be doing a breakdown of so you can subscribe to see those. And I'll see you guys later.